really scary. Oh. <laughs> Alright, good morning. Anyhow series once again and today I'm at this uh, Ubon Rachatani province and driving to explore the place and this place is actually about 120 kilometers away. So So finally, about an hour and 40 minutes of drive, I'm here. This is the not so secret location. Okay, it's a famous national park in Ubon Rajatani. Okay, Hatem National Park. What's so special about this place? It's really, really beautiful. Let's go and see. Okay, it's really beautiful. Okay, behind me, that river is actually Mekong River, and right opposite is actually Laos. So, did I also mention that this is a very popular place to watch sunset? So, every day they will actually have the weather forecast over here. So, today is the 4th of September. Okay, time of the sunrise 5 47. And time of the sunset is 6.09 p.m. Lowest. Okay, uh, in terms of temperature, 24. Highest, 30. All right. <laughs> so yeah, it's early for me right now. So I don't think I'll be catching the sunset. But it's very beautiful from what I searched from Google. So you should pay a visit. But anyway, there's some um, walking track over here, which I'm going to explore now and there's some actually painting on the wall right it says to be about 3000 to 4000 years old right a group of paintings scattered around the tree so okay let's see Okay, just look out for this signboard. It says "Trail down to see the painting," and beware of the slippery surface. Okay, and cliff, cliff painting trail. Okay, covers about three point four km. Interesting. Okay, three point four down and three point four up. That's going to be like six point eight. Okay, so on the right. When I came down, it says cliff painting. Okay, over here. But there is the cave on the left side, which I saw a signboard. Okay, Tam Nangli Cave. Okay, so maybe let's go check it out. Okay, so I'm gonna hop down a little. Okay, so we were there earlier. Alright, up there. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I think this is the end. Okay, I think I better hold on to my camera stick 
properly because anything sleep is sayonara. <sighs> Look at this underneath. Ah, so this is the tiny rock that supports the entire cliff above. Okay, just kidding. It just looks like it's supporting. Okay, so yeah, this is it. There's nowhere you can go. Ah, amazing. So let's head on to the cliff painting route. So this is the map of the cliff painting route. All right, as you can see from here, I'm here. All right, so it's going to take the route over here. There's four groups of painting, group one, two, three, four. So it's actually a loop and then eventually you come back here. As the saying goes, what goes up must come down. So enjoy now and suffer later. Okay, so this is the group one. Okay, just heading towards the group one painting. Pretty excited. Okay, so we are at the group one. It's very small, okay, you can see, right, it says over here, it says four huge fishes, an elephant and a figure of a four-legged animal, okay, it's not very clear, right, it's actually right on top, the edge over there. So here we are at this group 2 drawing. This is more obvious. Okay, as you can see on the big wall over there. Alright, so there's some painting of elephants, turtles, plums, giant catfish, and probably there's a fresh water stingray. Okay, I'm not sure what it is, but then this is actually more a lot more obvious. Very interesting, very nice. And they actually built a platform like this, you know, so you can go up and have a better view of it. Right? So this is group two, two more groups to go. Okay. Okay, I've reached this very slippery path. And there's actually water dropping on the top. So Slippery, but just have to get walking quickly and we can avoid as many water as possible. But I can't, but this pub is actually where the water drips. You can see my lens is covered with water. Okay, the short path. Oh, no. <laughs> slippery, slippery. Okay, be careful the shoe. Anyway, I'm just gonna wipe the lens. <sighs> okay, just rocky. So, that's I'm wearing a true shoe, but. Okay, okay. Go, go, go. <sighs> okay, slippery, slippery. Be careful. <laughs> the reach the fourth signboard it says fourth painting group I think I missed the third one oh shit that means I have to go back again or if not the friends of mine they'll tell me to redo okay let's go to the fourth one first and maybe I'll just go 
for another loop not for the third loop or have I taken the third loop <sighs> okay I found group 4 but oh it's very dangerous it's scary okay I just have to be very careful okay so it says this is group 4 okay it's got more human I guess alright so what should we do in group 4 should we just climb over Oh, that's quite dangerous, right? Let's see. Oh. Oh, where is this group for? But you can see there's this painting over here. But how am I supposed to go over? Let's put this thing over here and I expect people to walk over. I'm lost. I'm lost now. What should I do? Cross over this metal painting? Metal signboard? Or what? I mean definitely I can. I can choose to go from here. But sorry, I think I'm a chicken. I better or am I are we supposed to be uh, on this signboard, I'm not sure. Okay. Safely. This side. I don't know whether I should be doing this. I can't see the painting. I still haven't seen the painting yet. Oh, okay. Right now, I'm on this side of the cliff. I don't know, is this is supposed to? go like this but it's really scary oh. okay I don't think this is where we should be going okay let's do this Seems to be no wrong. There's a signboard is there, that means the painting should be there. Okay, so I think yeah, I'm not supposed to cross over here. Because it's kind of like a dead end really. So I have to head back and look for the painting. <sighs> so there's a reason why the signboard is there. To prevent people from crossing. Ah, <sighs> guess what? After some adventure, I finally, finally found a painting. It's just ahead of me. Okay, there are more human figure. Okay. A human with large leg. This is obviously a female. Okay, so we have found one, two, and group four. Okay, that's left with group three. So earlier we had one, and then walk, two. So, yeah, I probably might have missed number three of the signboard. Okay, it's supposed to be along the way. Okay, so now we are going to the car park, and then I will go all over again to find number three. Okay, number three. Uh, this is should not run. Should be cow. Ooh. Okay, 1.4 km to the car park. And I will redo again. Let's go. Okay, right back where we started. Alright, so so far I've covered 4.87 through hiking. I'm just gonna stop my watch and restart again. Okay, so it's finished. It's safe, say 4.88. Okay, then this time round, I'm just going to start with trail run. Ah, <sighs> let's go and find group number three. Let's go. So 
Oh, finally, number three. Uh, okay, so I was searching for it quite a while. I don't know where it is. Okay, it's actually on top. Here. Uh, uh, okay, it's on top there. Interesting. The cow is below. Uh, Ah, three. So now I have to run back either this way or that way. Just about there. I'm right in the middle. Okay, I'll do the same route back to the car park again. Three hundred meter. Scene is very nice. <laughs> 300 meter more. How do I go? Oh, down there. Okay. Ah, finally, I've reached. Okay, second loop. This is ah, our Tem National Park at Ubon, Rachatani. Okay. Quite a nice hike over here, pretty easy. You can actually bring your family and kids along. All right, and uh, it's also a nice place to watch the sunset. Okay, so hope you like this video. My battery going to flat really. Okay, and till the next Anyhow series. See you.